bucket list is a list of things you want to do before you kick the bucket. It's a guy who's very smart, but uh, he's been a, a garage mechanic. He wanted to do something else with his life, but uh, circumstances caught up with him and his sense of duty made him change his direction. So uh, instead of doing what he thought he wanted to do, he did what he thought he had to do. He's just got a head full of trivia. He's one of those people, he reads a lot. He's interested in all kinds of historical things. And um, so he, he's, a, he's a reader and he's a retentive reader. So uh, in Jeopardy is his perfect um, vehicle for him to show off. Jack's character is very rich. As a matter of fact, he owns a hospital. So, obviously, he doesn't want to be in a, in a public room, you know. It's a, but his decree was that only two people, never a, one person to a room, you know, at least two people to a room. So when he has to be hospitalized, he winds up in a room with <clears throat> someone else, you know. And, of course, it's... Uh, it's not an insurmountable problem for him, but uh, it's a problem. Sean Hayes, he's perfect. Uh, as Thomas, he's absolutely. When I read the script, I was kept reading Thomas. I wanted to, we are going to get to play this, this character, and, and come up with Sean, and it was it's just perfect casting. I did tell Rob that I had a son who was an actor, who would fit if he could pass the test, and that test was up to the director. And so he went and auditioned, and he did very well. So he got the job, he got the role. Um, it's, the importance is that uh, he has a chance to show his chops, and uh, I think he does it quite well. The film is being directed by Rob Reiner, um, and anybody who has seen any of his movies uh, will accept that he's one of the best. He has a deft hand. Um, he brings a, a, a lot of things to the movie, not least of which is me. <laughs> um, and one of the really gratifying surprising things about him is the way he works, which is at the speed of light.